What's up guys, welcome back. It's Saturday the 18th of November 2017 and more non-league action today. We've arrived at the Gore, which is um, home to Burnham FC, but we're watching Southall FC versus Bulldog Town today. Uh, I'm not sure if they ground share or something. I don't really know um, enough about these two teams, but uh, I am here with my kids again today. Yay! <laughs> and... Um, it's raining, unfortunately, which is a bit of a pain, but the ground looks fairly nice from the outside. We got it very early, so we've got a, a parking space. We're gonna pop inside in a minute and see if they've got any food. Um, but I can see from here, like a couple of fairly decent looking stands, I think. So we will find out. Uh, Mini Muzzy, what have you got um, for us? Hello, so I think it should be a very one-sided game today with Southall coming out with the three points. They have not lost a game yet in the Spartans South Midlands League. Yeah, I think this is like tier six. If you saw my um, Beaconsfield video, I kind of explained the, the, the setup a little bit. But um, Watford picked up uh, Kevin Phillips from Bulldog Town years and years ago when he was playing non league. So, and uh, as you know, Vardy played for a non league team when he was um, later discovered. So, it could happen. We could see some awesome players here today. Uh, Micro, what are you thinking? Yeah, click that subscribe button. Otherwise, Father Christmas is not going to see you. <laughs> okay. Uh, I bet on that. Give me a score prediction today. Um, so, I think it's going to be a 1-1. One, one. A draw. One yeah. Or, okay, we don't know any of the players, do we? No. Minnie, what are you thinking? I'm thinking 3-0 to... Southall. Yeah, okay, yeah, it's looking like a Southall win, but we don't know enough about either of the teams, so just hoping for a good game, really. All right, um, let's go and have a look then. stands on the other side so that uh, we've got the the nice stand behind us um, looks like Bulldog have got quite a mixture of um, young and older players uh, playing in blue today Southall in the red and white um, it was like 12 pounds to get in that was for me and the kids and a program and then a little food stall over there as well where we got hot dogs and uh, chips, quite nice. It's a nice, nice little ground actually. It doesn't look like it can hold very many people, but then there's probably only about maybe 20 people here at the most anyway. So uh, they don't really need it at the moment. Um, these two teams are both undefeated. Um, Southall's only draw this season is against Bulldog when they were away earlier, a one all draw. So hoping for uh, a good game today. Good attacking chance for Southall there in uh, what first five minutes. Oh, You're who? Yeah. You're who, sorry? Pinky. Yeah. I don't know. Everybody knows who's Pinky. Well, we do now, but we didn't before. Okay, so what is your role? You're just here to. Everything. Uh, Website. Right. Kit washed. Oh, nice, okay. Yeah, right. Treasurer, secretary, chairwoman. So it was one all, one all at your ground. Earlier yeah. this season. It was season. one all at our ground. I reckon it'll be 2 1 today. You're to going to win 2 1. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Pinky, thank you very much for your time. My Cheers. It's <laughs> another good chance for Southall wasted there, unfortunately.
Both teams have had their chances so far in this first half. Uh, it's been quite scrappy, but fairly even so far. Hmm. Bit of a dodgy challenge there. Referee was a little bit slow to um, stop play there after that one. Although it was not intentional. And there's the first goal, 1 0 Southall. Well taken. <laughs> it's the only useful thing that kid has done all day. Good punch out by the keeper. It's fallen back to a south all player. Whipped in. Half time. It's 1 0 to south all here at half time. Been a very scrappy game, but um, not. Not because either team have been playing badly, it's, it's been raining constantly and um, very, very difficult game, but both teams have battled really hard so far, so uh, I'm looking forward to the second half. Second half's about to start, how are you feeling about the first half? Uh, it was pretty even, but I think Southall led it a bit and had a few more chances and put one of them away. Do you think Bulldog are going to come back into it in the second half? I reckon they'll get one goal, but I think Southall will get uh, one more or two more. How's the hot chocolate? It's actually pretty good. No, it's not. It's horrible. No, it, no, it's it horrible. Is it is it's horrible. Good. It's good. It's not. Good defending by Bulldog. Another really close half so far. Uh, and we've moved back over to the other side of the stand stadium so that we've got a nice background. Good defending again from Bulldog. Oh! Off the post. No, no challenge for it. Do you think there's going to be any more goals in this game? Uh, I think the blue team. Blue team. Bulldog. Yeah, Bulldog. Yeah. Um, they're going Do you even know where ball. we are right now? Yeah, we're in... Um, oh, what's their <laughs> name? The sh so, Lino's just called the referee over to have a private chat with him. And that's it, he's done nothing. Maybe they were making plans for later on this evening. The rain is absolutely hammering it down now. The pitch is um, in a bit of a state. The players are struggling now to stay on their feet. Some more sloppy tackles are coming in. But still 1-0 to Southall. Think him, Mini. I think Bulldog has been the better side in this half, but they're struggling to find the net. They've had quite a few opportunities, but they can't seem to like... Struggling to find their cut. strikers, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Uh, they have been a lot better. Rain is really causing a lot of issues for all the players now. Oh! How did he save that? Free kick to Bulldog, unlucky not to score there. I don't know how the keeper managed to get it into his hands while he was laying on the floor, but done well. Oh, that was a great tackle. Southall still on the ball though. Another good block. Defensively, they're doing well. Oh, I just, I just missed that. I caught it out of the corner of my eye. Bit of an elbow to the face that was. Um. I don't think it was deliberate, but he definitely caught him. Um, yeah, defensively, Bulldog are doing well, but when they go on the attack, they've only got one or two players going up front. It's going to be like one of the last attempts now for uh, for Bulldog to get a point out of this. It's a free kick to him in their own half.
still just can't get through the Southall defence. That's it, final whistle, 1 0 to Southall. So that's it, it's finished 1-0 to Southall here. Uh, congratulations to them, still top of the league, undefeated. Um, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and please click on the subscribe button. That would be awesome. Don't forget to comment down below as well and let us know if um, there is a game in particular that you think that we should be covering. Until then, thank you very much. Laters. Thank you.